morning. Good morning, everybody out there today. This is Linus and Arise coming to you this morning. And I know that there are a lot of somber hearts out there, and that you all are discouraged. Well, I come to give you a good word today. Now, you know, guys, I always start my segments off with scripture. That's how I fight this war with the word of the Most High. His word is sharper than a two edged sword. Uh, um, cutting asunder soul and spirit. So here's my scripture today, and this is especially towards uh, going to be for YouTube and Facebook and all of you major social media giants, okay, and the things that you all are doing out there and taking off good media, uh, good take, uh, the leading truth, and people that are speaking for truth and standing up for righteousness. Woe unto them that call evil good and good evil and put darkness for light and light for darkness that put bitter for sweet and sweet for bitter that's for YouTube Facebook and all the social medias and this one is for my people this scripture is for my people okay this is Ezekiel chapter 2 verses 6 all right I want you to please listen carefully to this description please read it meditate on it and um, you know it will it will strengthen you now I'm gonna read it it says and those son of man be not afraid of them neither be afraid of their words though their briars and thorns be with thee and thou do dwell among scorpions be not afraid of their words nor be dismayed at their looks though they be a rebellious house and here is my uh, scripture that I have been enforced with okay and this is what I'm run this is what I'm representing okay this is Psalm 44 and this is what I'm ready for okay blessed be Yah my strength would teach my hands to war and my fingers to fight my goodness my fortress my high tower my deliverer my shield and he in whom I trust who subdue it my people under me Yah what is man that thou take knowledge of him O son of man that make account of him man is like vanity his days are a shadow that pass it away bow thy heavens Yah and come down touch the mountains and they shall smoke cast forth lightning and scatter them shoot out thy arrows and destroy them okay that's the word today now I know that people out there today uh, are dealing with so much. And this is kind of going to be like a, a, a variety of things. And I pay the cry of my people because this is exactly what's going on right now. People are crying all over the world, all over the place. Black people, we've been crying. Uh, from the moment we've been in bondage, we've been crying. But I want you people to understand something. Do not become frustrated with YouTuber, with YouTube, Facebook, all these social media giants, they all work for the same man. They all work for the Zionists, the Jews, the crypto Jews. This is the agenda. They're all part of it. So that's why they're deleting all of the things that are good and righteous and the truth. But you know what? They can't stop it. Let them do what they must because they're only doing it in vain. They may fool everybody out there about what they're doing and make people believe that they have all this power and you are intimidating people, you're scaring people. All of you all are working together in one purpose. We already know this. But what I want people to understand, because most of you all are fighting this war in the physical, and that's why you all seem uh, you are becoming disheartened and discouraged. When you fight this war with the spirit, you will subdue them. You will have no fear. I, as I told you before in my segment that says have faith, I don't care what it looks like. I don't care what it feels like. I don't care what it sounds like. You all got to stand on the word. And that's the problem with all of you all out here today is that you're not standing on the word. You have so many different doctrines that you all are following and it's not doing you any justice. It's not doing you any good because there's no fruit in it. You have to go back to the source that supplies the spirit. The one who put the spirit in your body. That's who you have to go back to. That's the one who gives you the power. That's the one where the power comes from. Yah! Yeshua! Yah Yeshua! How you want to identify him? Jesus! 
And I don't call God uh, God because his name is not God. His name was taken out of the book 7,000 times. When the devil uh, petitioned the white man or his children to rewrite the King James, he took out the Most High's name 7,000 times. He also put an, I, I, uh, it's called italics words. Italics, the one that looks like um, italicized. Those were added in. Those words were added in. So when you see those words, you don't got to say them. You can actually just stick with the ones that are unitalicized. Uh, un Listen, people. This is real. This is the real deal. These people could only overcome you if one, because you are filled with fear. Half of these people ain't real. They're probably most of them reptilians. They're dev the devil's dominions, demigods. Half of the people in Congress and United States of your government are all controlled by reptilians and, and, and aliens, so-called alien, that alien bullshit that they're running down your throat. They came in the fuck, excuse my language, they came in disguise talking about their aliens because they sell you a lot of fantasy. And they made friends with you. You cannot make friends with the devil. He is just using these people and he will destroy them when he is done with them. You people in Hollywood, you, you actresses, you rappers, again, you sold yourself out. You forsake yourself when you sold yourself for gold. There is no uh, uh, fruit in your gold. Your gold cannot save you. Your money cannot save you. Your fast cars, your big fancy houses, none of that shit's going to save you now. Okay? See, they, they took you in. They did what they needed to do with you. They used you. They caused you to brainwash the masses. And now they threw with you. And now they're going to kick you to the curb. That's how the devil works. Don't you all understand that? He has no friends. The devil don't have no goddamn friends. Even the fucking damn Zionists, them damn crypto Jews. That's who he used. He had to use his own children because that is his seed. Those Zionist crypto Jews in Israel who are running the show are his seed. And that damn Taliban and Judaism shit that they try to uh, replace with Christianity and the gospel. But we know that they will go, they're, going to, they're going to fail. The devil already knows he's already doomed. He is doomed. And you all keep giving him the, uh, uh, making him, uh, giving the impression that he's, uh, he's got all this power. He's got it because you all gave it to him. You all gave him the power. You all believed in him. You all uplift him. So therefore, he has that power over you because you have allowed it. But let me tell you something. You only got power over those he allowed. Not the ones that, who believe and follow you Okay? I want you to understand this. See? So, you know, for, you know, for all of you all sellouts, and then you got the conscious community that uh, throwing out all kinds of knowledge, confusing the people more than they already are. You all are going to suffer the consequences because you know the truth. People need to be know about what is going on right now. We are on the brinks of war. There's war internally in the United States of America. The cops are going around killing, uh, threatening, intimidating, abusing people based on order. Based on this new world order they want to put in effect. As for Trump, that, that fake man you all think is a president is a damn reptile or a clone. Okay, they're all puppeteers following the agenda. Okay? You all need to stop focusing on their shit. Focus on the Most High. I told you before, the Most High said, there are more of us than there are them. And you keep, don't you know everything is, a, a, is all about illusion? The devil's power is limited to here. The devil's power is limited to what you give him. And you keep giving him power. He can only feed off your fear. When this all said and done, you're going to see the devil for who he really is. He's nothing but a little shit man. A little piece of shit man. That keeps, uh, make, you all remember Wizard of Oz? Watch Wizard of Oz and then you will know what the devil looked like. What the devil is. A little tiny man. Who has no flipping power but because of what you gave him. And of course he has to fulfill Yah's purpose. Yah's purpose, right? Because Yah is the one in control. He's fooled everybody so deceitfully, so treacherously. Like, you know, like it's like a stinging scorpion. He's, he's deceived you so bad. Everyone has been deceived. Anyways, um, this message was about, again,
keeping people on track. Don't worry about Facebook. Don't worry about YouTube. Let me tell you something. They, this thing is not going to go down until y'all is ready for it to go down. You see? And I don't care what YouTube do. I don't care what Facebook do. And all these other social media giants. Let me tell you something. The Most High got this. Okay? And let them do what they must. And woe unto them who always put evil for good. Because they've already sealed their soul. Okay? It's just a matter of time. We're just going through the motions, people. We're just going through the motions. Okay? But there is victory at the end for those who firmly believe. Okay? Let me read the scripture to you. And please, people, you need to read scripture. Um, Psalm, I'm sorry, Psalm 144. Blessed Yah, my strength, would teach my hands to walk and my fingers to fight. Hey, I'm ready. I'm ready. Okay? You all need to read Ezekiel. Those son of man, do not be afraid of them. Neither be afraid of their words. Though their briars and thorns be with thee. And you dwell among scorpions. Be not afraid of their words. Nor be dismayed at their looks. They're nothing but punks. Don't you know that? They're punks. Even them damn reptilians. They only can get you when you become fearful. But they have positioned you in a way because they have brainwashed you guys for so long. And they have not told you the truth. So when you see these things, you all are going to bug out. Because you're not have been in reality. You have not been given the truth and you've not been living in reality. You have been they've caused you guys to live in a fantasy land. In a, in a world of illusion, not reality. So seeing them on TV and seeing them on various YouTubes is different when you see them up close and personal. Okay? You're not spiritually ready. And they wanted you to be that way. So that way you couldn't fight them. Because when you're spiritually strong and you're spiritually armored, they can't do a damn thing to you. In fact, you can kill them. If you're really new, if you know about it, you need to research. You all need to stop covering your heads, staying in the dark, and come and find the truth. Because where there is truth, there is power. Okay? Where there is knowledge, there is power. And when you find knowledge and power, you will find Yah. You will find Yeshua. Because that's where the power is. When you stand with them, everybody is gone on to their own doctrine. And you all are confused. And you all are running around like chickens with your head cut off. Because you can't figure it out. Everyone thinks they got this truth and that truth. But no, my dear friends, you got to go back to the beginning and stop listening to these damn people telling you the Bible is not true. The, there is truth in the Bible. Open it. There is a supernatural truth in the Bible. You must open it and read it. It will give you what you need. I guarantee you that. Now, all right, I'm going to stop here. Uh, you be all be blessed. This is the rest of the song for YouTubes and let you all know what's coming to you guys. It's over. It's all over. It's a wrap. Yah is on the premises. <laughs> Babylon,